Well, howdy, folks. Welcome back to my channel, and welcome to Kazoo Fridays, another episode. Now, of course, if you've been following this series for a while, I've got the playlist up on the screen here, and I'll also uh, link it in the description. I've explored lots of different kazoos, and today's video is one that I can't believe I haven't thought of before now, and it's make your own kazoo out of household materials. Now, you might say, hey, way back when you made this Black Owl Guitars kazoo kit, and that was making your own kazoo, and that's very true. And you also might say, Chris from Applied Wizarding sent me this kazoo, and he made that himself, so those are homemade kazoos, and you are correct. But I'm not talking about making something like that. I'm just talking about improvising a kazoo out of household materials, like this PVC scrap. So this here is a PVC scrap I had in my uh, plumbing parts box. It's a half inch piece of PVC, and I've mentioned this before in some of my other videos, but PVC is measured across the opening, not across the actual pipe. So it's a half inch across that opening. Um, I also drilled a hole through it here, and I used a 5 16 bit and uh, just drilled a hole right through uh, the top of the PVC there. Now, I'm sure that you could do some prototyping. You could figure out what the optimum length is, what the optimum size of a hole is, but I'm just doing this one as the prototype. Now, I thought of this idea last night and I said to myself, okay, I should try to make a couple prototypes and then make a video. But then I thought, you know what might be more fun is to just make the prototyping the actual video. So this is gonna be the first time I've tried this. And if you're seeing this video, it means it worked. Because otherwise you're not gonna see this video. So anyway, you start with the piece of PVC. You drill a hole through it. By the way, I also sanded off the logos just to make it look a little nicer, but you don't really have to do that. I've got a rubber band over here. I'm gonna use that in a second. And I've got some cigarette papers. Now, if you remember, a while back I did a video in the Kazoo Friday series where I looked at different, uh, using different membranes. And one of them that I really liked was using the cigarette paper. Of course, you can use wax paper, uh, candy wrappers, and a number of other things too. But the point is you need some sort of a reed. Here we go, here's our cigarette paper. And then I'm gonna take my scissors here and I'm gonna cut it off into approximately a square. It doesn't have to be perfect, but there we go. So that's gonna be my kazoo reed, okay? I'm gonna take my reed here and just to make this a little bit simpler, I'm gonna kinda trim off the edges just a little bit so it's maybe just a little more round and hopefully that'll help it uh, be a little bit easier to attach to the end of the PVC. But in any case, again, this step might be optional, but there we go. Now I've got something that's approximately, you know, kinda circular, kinda oval to go over the end. So I'm gonna put that over the end of the PVC here, okay? like that, and I wanna get this fairly tight across the end, right, because it's what's gonna do the vibration. So I'm gonna take a little piece of tape here, and I'm gonna tape this side in place, just like that. So I just put a piece of tape there to tape that side in place, and then I'm gonna pull it across and do the same thing on the other side so that this stays fairly tight across the top of the PVC there, okay? It's so another piece of tape scrap here. I already pre-cut these, and I'm gonna tape that one in place too. So there we go. So now our reed is in place there, but we don't want it just flapping like that. So we're gonna take the rubber band that I had earlier, and we're gonna kind of pull it across the edge here. See that? Okay, and so now what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna take that rubber band and put it around here, and I'll probably have to twist it. Oh, okay, who thought this was gonna be the hardest part of the construction? There we go. <laughs> have to twist it maybe three or four times around the reed. There you go, hopefully you can see that. And so if I, it's fairly tight. So if I did this correctly, it should sound like a kazoo when I blow into it. But hey, for a prototype, I think we've proved that this can work. So if you're ever in a situation where you need a kazoo and you don't have one, just get yourself a piece of pipe, put a hole in it, put something across the end to be a membrane, and you've got an instant kazoo. You know, great project for the kids or whatever. Here you go. Thank you for tuning in today. If you like Kazoo Fridays or if you like this video, please give it a thumbs up for me. And if you like this type of content, I would really appreciate it if you would subscribe for me. All right, I'll see you guys soon.